Hey, how's it going? It's Adam, AKA The Real Simso. Welcome to episode two of the Digimon X playthrough. Now in our last episode, we went through and we hatched three different eggs on these X devices. We have an XA, an XC, and an XD. And those Digimon are turning out to be some awesome Digimon. We put them through a gauntlet that I like to call the Love, Luxury, and Survive tournament, where effectively, depending on how they fought against each other, I'm raising them differently. And now they've reached the rookie stage. And I gotta tell you, these are some awesome rookie Digimon with a lot of potential, a lot of potential. The roster is on these devices are just insanely amazing. Last episode, we also talked a lot about the Digimon X lore, and we're going to replicate some of that today by making them go through the tournament area, which is kind of what I talked about in our last episode. The other thing we're going to do is put them through a preliminary round to see how they fare off after they've evolved. Then we're going to put them through that area I mentioned, and then we'll have our final showdown between the three to determine how they're going to fare over the next little bit. Are they going to get to live a life of luxury, love, or are they going to have to survive again? How do you think they'll fare? Let's see how the Royal Knights deal with this dilemma that they're facing themselves in. Lilithmon is broken out of the dark area, and all of the demon lords are likely to get out as well. The evil Digimon are swarming, and the Royal Knights aren't sure what to do. Poor Examon is absolutely being swarmed. So let's find out today what happens next. Don't forget, this is a community playthrough, so what I want you to do is go out and hatch an X device. Get them up to rookie stage and email me at therealsimzo at gmail.com, link down in the description, so that way I can put a picture of you and your Digimon living your life or out in the wild having a good time in my videos and share that with the community. I think that would be an absolute blast, and for every video that you participate in, I'm going to put an extra entry into the As Maria giveaway that I'll be doing at the end of this playthrough. Don't forget, that's a global giveaway too, so you can be anywhere in the, the world and I'll do the best I can to get that thing to you. We're also going to do a huge tournament at the very end of this. Me versus you. Your Digimon versus mine. If you have an ACOM, a Wi-Fi COM, or a DCOM, you'll be able to send your Digiroms to me at the end when we get to Ultimate, and we'll have a huge tournament. It'll be a blast. Now let's go check out these rookie Digimon. Our Digimon evolved into an Agumon, a Gobamon, and an Impmon X. Check out Gobamon, just enjoying being out in the river. Living an absolute life of love. And here we've got our Agumon X living that life of luxury. While I left Impmon to be a little goblin in the gutter. Having to survive. Check these rookies out. I think these are awesome with Digimon. All right, here we are for our tournament mode. So if you'll remember from the last episode, we have got the silver device or the XC who is in first place. We have got the red X or XA in second place. And then we have the gold or the XD in third place. So we've got Gomamon X, Agumon X, and Impmon X. So at this point, we're gonna go ahead and have them battle. I've not done any trainings. Nobody's got care mistakes. Everybody has been for the most part well fed since their evolution line. So they should all be ready to go. But before we get started, Let's do a pack of Digimon cards. Let's see what we got. Tobiomon, Tank Dramon, Mekumon, Skull Scorpiomon, Aqua Viper, Seberusmon, Golmon, Babungamon, <laughs> Agunimon, Sunflowmon, Commandramon, Whoa, Dan Devimon. That's a cool card. Super cool. Super cool. All right, now let's duke it out. Round one, Agumon X versus Gomamon X. Let's go. Oh wow, nice, that is one point for the black red device, Agumon. Nice fight, Agumon, that's awesome. Let's go ahead and get Gomamon healed up. Looks like that uh, love may not have paid off too much for you there, buddy. That is one point for Agumon. Next up, we have got Impmon X versus Gomamon X. Gold versus silver. Four and a one, dang. Looks like all that training in Life of Love did not help XC there. Oh man, I didn't get excellence on either of those. Maybe it'll make it a little bit more fair of a fight. Oh, 
Oh, wow. What a standoff. Which one's going to get it? Oh, wow. Impmon X. <laughs> That's incredible. They're still in the fight. Still in the fight. Last one. Who's going to take it? What? Wow. The XC. Jeez. He is just having a go. That is going to put him in last place. We've now got a point for gold and we've got a point for red. Dang. All right, next up is going to be gold and black. Let's see how they fare off. Ooh, wow, red's doing a, a good dice roll on that one. All right, here we go. Try and get excellence for them both. I think I got it. Nice. Who are you guys rooting for? Curious to know. Comments down below. Nice close-ups. Woo! Oh man, Impmon taking it down. Wow, so the red device has got two points. So that's our winner. That's incredible. So red went from the luxury life into the love life. So we're gonna be training him. We're gonna be doing all kinds of good stuff with him. Now we've got gold in second place. So they've redeemed themselves. They're gonna get to, to live a little bit of a life of luxury. And poor Gomamon over here. All that training, everything that I did for him, taking good care of him. And now he's gonna have to survive. Best of luck, pal. headquarters and we are going to go ahead and put these rookies through the tournament area and I'm pretty stoked to get started so in first place in the preliminary round we had the X red device with our Agumon X and basically because he is now in the love status or the love category we're going to take him through the tournament area and we're going to let him get roughly three entries is my thoughts I think that'd be a kind of a good way to do it basically give each of the Digimon a certain amount of lives based off of the preliminary rounds and put them through the areas based on how many injuries they get. So we're gonna give this guy three. Now, in second place, we had the gold device, which was our Ipmon X. Uh, really stoked to see this guy make a bit of a comeback. Now he is living the life of luxury. So what we're gonna do for him is actually only make him have one injury. Once he gets one injury, he's gonna duck out of that tournament because he's just chilling. He doesn't have to deal with the tournament right now. He's, like I said, living a life of luxury. Now, that being said, with the silver device, he was in first. Now, he's dropped all the way down into last place in third. And uh, basically, because he's going to have to survive, he is going to have five injuries that he's going to have to get through. So we're going to make him really just push through that and uh, see how far he can make it. All right, so let's take these rookies through the tournament. So we're going to go ahead and get started with Gomamon X here. Now, as I mentioned earlier, he's going to have five chances to make it through these different areas. Now, since Gomamon X is in the survive mode, I figure we're going to go ahead and give him an experience module. Uh, he is doing everything he can to get ahead of the game. Especially after he fell from grace. Let's take him into area two. Check out Gomamon X's sprite. I think that sprite is just so cool. All right, here we go, Impmon X. So basically with him being in second place previously, he's now living that life of luxury and we're going to let him have one injury and then he can just duck out. And our awesome Agumon X here, who has been living the life of love, been taking pretty good care of this guy. So it is time for him to go ahead and start working his way through the tournament. We just need to give him a little bit of strength here. I should fill him up. Nice. All right. And let's go. Previously, we saw Examon fall in battle against Lilithmon X, signaling the beginning of the seven deadly Digimon's rise. The dark area is now overflowing with evil Digimon, and the royal knights are struggling to hold back the tide, but the worst is yet to come. Lilithmon X's victory sends shockwaves to the digital world. Meanwhile, within the dark area, tensions between two other members of the seven deadly Digimon, Dark Knightmon and Barbamon, reach a boiling point. Dark Knightmon, with its cruel and power-hungry nature, battles Barbamon over control of their combined wealth and authority. But when the two Digimon realize that the old and new digital worlds are about to be linked via the Dark Area, their feud takes a new direction. 
United in their greed, both Dark Nightmon and Barbamon X-Evolve, acquiring X-Antibodies and setting their sights on the treasure of the new digital world. No Digimon dares to challenge them, and those left in the wake of their destruction can only quiver in fear, waiting for the Royal Knights to arrive. Just when things couldn't get worse, another nightmare emerges. Creepymon, or Daemon, now fully X-Evolved, stands as powerful as the ultimate Digimon it once sought to revive. With the old digital world in shambles and the dark area in chaos, Creepymon X sees this as the perfect opportunity to test its newfound strength. This is no ordinary rampage. It's a prelude to something much darker. Creepymon X is preparing for the ultimate battle, the showdown against the Royal Knights themselves. And behind it all, the true mastermind emerges, Lusamon Chaos Mode. To Lusamon, the chaos of the dark area is a grand spectacle, a perfect opportunity to fulfill a long-held desire the complete destruction of the digital world. Lusamon's plan is clear. X-Evolve every member of the seven deadly Digimon and bring forth utter devastation. His next step? Deploying Beelzemon X to the battlefield and awakening the dormant forces of Leviamon and Belphamon. With Examon's defeat, the invasion of the Dark Area begins in earnest. As Craniumon X and Kintarismon X rush to the epicenter of the explosion, they are met with a horrifying sight. From the gate of the dark area emerge Leviamon X and Belphamon X, their power now amplified by X antibodies. But Lusamon is not done yet. Deep in the bottom strata of the dark area, the final member of the seven deadly Digimon is awakened, Beelzemon X. Released by Lusamon's twisted will, Beelzemon X emerges with a vile smirk, ready to wreak havoc across the old digital world. With all seven deadly Digimon now fully X evolved, their combined power threatens to crush everything in their path. In a last-ditch effort to save the digital world, Jessmon X mounts a desperate defense, battling an unending tide of evil Digimon pouring from the dark area. But the situation worsens when Beelzemon X and Lusamon X appear, both intent on destroying everything Jessmon X stands for. Jessmon X, realizing he's outmatched, prepares for the worst, but just when all hope seems lost, a familiar figure appears, Jessmon's mentor, Genkumon. With Genkumon's arrival, a new battle begins. Genkumon faces off against Lusamon X, while Jessmon X squares off against Beelzemon X in an all-out war for the fate of the digital world. With Lusamon X's plan proceeding without a hitch and the seven deadly Digimon united under his control, the evil force's morale surges to terrifying heights. Their X-evolved forms now pose a dire threat to not only the old digital world, but the new digital world as well. The digital world is hanging by a thread. With the seven deadly Digimon fully X-evolved and united, can the Royal Knights stop the wave of darkness? Will Jessmon X and Gankumon turn the tide, or is it already too late? And before you go, big shout out to our sponsor, which is you. It is the Digimon community. All of you are so amazing, and I had so many awesome folks reach out and wanting to be part of the X Hatch. I've already got a couple of codes that I cannot wait to battle near the end of the X playthrough. And let's check out some awesome Digimon from all of you. First up, we got someone I'm going to refer to as Les from France, who is hatching on the DMXD. Look at this awesome mint mom that he has already got, and check out those cool doggos. Next up, we've got Surreal, who also went ahead and sent me some codes. They're raising Skull, Baluchimon, Mega Seedramon X, and Angel Woman X. How freaking awesome are these? And then up next, my buddy Wario Digifarm. Check out this guy. Squiggity with the Wiggity. The Wiggity Mon X, a matter of fact. What am I doing? I'm doing an X hatch with the real Sismo. Why are you doing it? Because if it was the fake Sismo, then I wouldn't be doing a hatch with the real Sismo. Anyway, we got two X antibodies. The X to the D, and back to back C and D. We got the Wiggy Mon X C. That's the one with Dark Tyrannomon and whatnot in the Gobi. And then we be running the XD. The XD is the one with all the demons. And then you got the fish dragon boys. And then you got the Ogamon and the Yitmon and the Beelzemon and the Starmon. But anyway, we're going to see how these two are going to raise because you already seen that it was a Gobi. And you already saw that it was an Itmon. Who's it gonna turn into next? Dude, you have find me cracking up. I absolutely love this video. Amazing out. creativity. I absolutely love it. And next up, we've got DigimonQ8 on Instagram. So check out this awesome Daemon. 
And next up, we got Digi Nook with this awesome Rhino Mon X, another awesome Instagrammer. Hey there, it's Hannah, and here is Gabumon on my 90s Taco Bell colored X device. Cheers, everybody. Good luck. Have fun. And next up, my buddy Connor is joining the hatch. Here we are, starting up the XC. Timon. And last but not least, another returner. We've got Rusty Chimon. Check out this one. I just absolutely love what you've done with your device. That is so cool. The resin, everything about it. some absolutely incredible Digimon. Thank you so much for hatching with me. I hope you're having as much fun as I am. We're back out in the woods today and we're going to put our Digimon through the final test, the final uh, battle basically. So we're going to give our Gomamon X a chance to potentially get into second place. We're going to see if Itmon X can stand up to first and maybe even steal first place. It's going to be an awesome battle and I'm out in a beautiful trail that I've not been on in a long time. I think it's going to be the perfect place for our little arena though. So let's go put these rookies to the test. And so our Agumon X has currently made it to level three, as you can see here. And as far as the tournament mode goes, he ended up making it to area five. And in second place, we've got Impmon X, who currently is at level three as well, I believe. Yep, level three as well. And you, as you can see, he's also at area five. And you can see our Gomamon X, who was previously in first place and is now in last. He was able to make it up to, let's see, level three as well. And what's wild is he actually made it all the way to area 12. I was really, really impressed by that. I could not believe he made it that far. So pretty cool, pretty cool. And because of the way that I'm running these tournaments, he's actually gonna have the ability to potentially come back and be in at least second place. So he might have a chance to redeem himself. We'll just have to see. Before we kick this tournament off, let's go ahead and do a pack of the day. Super excited to be getting into the Digimon cards. I went to my local card shop recently and I have just been picking up cards left and right. I cannot wait to go play some Digimon cards. Let's see what we got. Growmon, Strike Dramon, Mephistomon, Ground Locomon, Istevimon, ADR03 Pendulum Feet, <laughs> ADR08 Optimizer, Ceceramon, Yaman! Oh nice, we finally got one! I wish I had had this a couple weeks ago to represent our Yaman. Kazushiota. Mother D Reaper. Oh sweet, cool foil terrier mon. How awesome is that? All right, now let's go ahead and get into the tournament. All right, here we go. So first up, we're gonna go ahead and determine the first spot winner. So we're gonna have our Agumon X versus our Impmon. 
Now, whoever wins this will take first place. Let's go. Let's check out our Xy rolls. Nice, man. Agumon's wanting to keep first place, that's for sure. It's kind of hard to see who's gonna pull it off though. Oh wow, did Impmon make a complete return? Dang, and out of first place is Agumon and Impmon. Wow, coming back all the way from being a gutter goblin to being the champion of today's episode. Congratulations, Impmon. That is just awesome. You deserve all the congratulations, man. Nice work coming back from all of that. All right, here we go. The final match is gonna be between Agumon X and Gomamon X. Now, this could potentially bump Agumon back down into last place. It could put Gomamon into second place. So we'll just have to see how this goes. All right, let's get our Xy roll in. Nice rolls, guys, nice rolls. Here we go. Wow, first big hit from Agumon. This is gonna be a quick one. Dang, Gomamon X is down. That was fast. All right, so Agumon gets to keep his second place. Gomamon is staying in last, and our Impmon, geez, I am just so stoked about this. I cannot believe he went from being a gutter goblin to being the champion of today's episode. How awesome is that? And there you have it, folks. So our Impmon X is in first place. He decided he no longer wanted to be trashed on. He wanted to be taken care of. He wanted to be trained. So we're gonna get him trained up. He'll have full effort and no more care mistakes. And then in second place, our Agumon fought hard. He wanted that life of luxury, and I can't say I blame him. Did you see that sushi earlier? Delicious stuff. So he's going to be living that life of luxury, continuing on. He will not get any more training, and he'll be taken very good care of. And then in last place, we've got our Gomamon X. I can't believe it, honestly. I really thought this device would come out on top. He is going to be getting all kinds of care mistakes. I'll probably put him through the tournament mode a little bit more, get him leveled up even more. We're just going to hammer him. We're going to get him through everything. And I cannot wait to see who these guys turn into because I have no idea. I'm not looking at any guides. And I really appreciate everybody that is hatching along with me. I hope you guys are having as much fun as I am. I'm really, really having a blast. Thank you so much to everybody that's already participated. And if you're just now tuning in, don't worry about it. Go ahead and go hatch an X device and send me some pictures. I don't care what stage you're at. If you make it to Ultimate and you have an ACOM, a Wi-Fi COM, DCOM, whatever, send me a battle code and I will fight you at the end. But otherwise, I hope you're out there having fun, having a great adventure with your Digimon, and take care, everybody. And we'll see you next time for our champion Digimon.